Hi, welcome to Spirit Calling Kids. I'm Michael Wheeler, author of the Spirit Calling Devotionals and the Proud Papa series of children's books. If you like these videos, please hit the thumbs up button and share them with a friend. Now, please join us as we sing the Spirit Calling song. Don't hide your faith, let it grow and blossom for everyone to see. Whatever is hidden away will be brought out into the open, and whatever is covered up will be uncovered. Mark 4:22. I liked to play hide and go seek when I was little. I also wanted to play peekaboo when I was younger as well. I think that hiding and having someone try to find you is exciting. It is like being in the dark, it is a little scary at first, and it is fun to have other kids look for you. When they find you, it is exciting as well. Where was your favorite place to hide when you played hide and go seek? I like to hide under my bed and place stuffed animals in front of me to help hide me. The kids looking for me couldn't always see behind the stuffed animals. But with all games, once you're found, you are out in the open for everyone to see. I guess life is a lot like hide and go seek. You can try and hide things from people. But you usually feel better when everything is out in the open, where people can help you or try to understand why you were hiding things. Mr. Brown doesn't hide stuff, he tries to bring them out of the ground so everyone can see what he raises. Besides, no one would look for asparagus if you hit it. Let's join Farmer Brown now. You were meant to shine, my lovely child. Things that I created to shine have no choice but to stand up and glow like the sun. Every morning the sun rises in the east side of the earth and pushes the darkness away. The sun has no other choice but to shine. Every night the stars come out and shimmer like fireflies in the night sky. The stars have no choice, they were meant to shine. When you plant a seed in the spring, the rain and sun help the seed do what it is created for, to grow and blossom and bloom. You learned from the parable of the sower of seeds that some things can stop the seed from growing, but it was created to grow and blossom. I made you and blessed you with the ability to think, talk, and communicate with other children. Communication is essential if you want to understand and get along with other people. Communication is also how you can shine and let people know about me, my child. The good news about Jesus dying and rising for your sins is worthy of telling others about it. The good news can't be hidden, it must be shared and communicated with everyone so they will know about it. Telling people about Jesus is like taking a cover off of the good news. If a person didn't know about Jesus, and you tell them, you uncovered a gift to them from me. Thank you for sharing my good news, my child. The good news is the story about Jesus. Please share the story with other children. There is more good news, my child. You are the good news for today. You carry my message within you. Thank you for joining us today. I pray that you had a good time, learned a lot and were blessed by your time with us. Now let's join Amelia, Quinn, Addie and Alice as they sing our blessings. And always remember, there is nothing closer to you than the Spirit of God.